Hey guys, it's Jake, and welcome to day nine of learning to program in Ruby. Today, we're going to be going over hashes again. And this time, instead of having the user's input be printed out, we are just going to store the hashes. But first, let's real quickly do a little bit more involved hash from the last episode. Let's ask the user what their first name is only. Puts. What's your first name? We're going to create a variable of first underscore name. And we are going to set that equal to gets dot chomp. Then we're going to ask them, how old are you? Puts Let's divide these up. Puts, how old are you? Your underscore age, I'm gonna create that variable. We're gonna set that to gets.chomp again. And let's put how many kids they have. Puts, how many kids do you have? And let's do kid amount is equal to gets dot chomp. And let's ask them one more question. Are you male or female? Puts. Are you male or female? Don't forget our question mark. And we will make this variable male underscore female. Is equal to gets dot chomp. Okay, now we want to print out what their answers are into a sentence. So let's do puts you are a, and we want this one to be the age. So let's do our hashtag and our curly brace your age and let's put a period at the end of that you are oh no no period you are a your age you are a 20 year old and then we want their male or female so we'll do hashtag curly brace and male underscore female underscore female my mic <laughs> you are a your age year old male period after that Your name is hashtag. We're going to make their name their scroll back over here. First name. First underscore name. Got to keep that on the outside. And you have hashtag curly braces kid amount. Is that what it was? Kid amount. Oh. 
Did a mount. Curly braces. I think I'm. That's good. Children. Put a period there. Okay, so it's going to put out you are a 21 year old male. Your name is Jackson. And you have four children. That's actually <laughs> four children at 21. Um, all right. So let's save this as who, who are you? Dot RB. Let's open our command prompt. Pull that file in. And if you listen, if you watched the last episode, you know what is going to happen here. Who are you? There we go. Pull that in. Hit enter. What is your first name? It's Jake. How old are you? Ninety-nine. No, no, no. A hundred and eleven. Wait, no, no, no. Hundred and eleven. Teeth? Yes. How many kids do you have? One hundred. Are you male or female? Hmm. Robot. Enter. You are an 111 year old robot. Your name is Jake, and you have a hundred children. Fantastic. Okay. Obviously, I could put the right answers in here, or ones that make sense. So that was a review from last week. But what I'm going to show you today is how to put all that information into a hash. So let's get rid of the puts line right here. And just kill that. What you're going to do is create a new hash. But first, we need to name it. We're going to name it Facebook underscore knows all spooky and then we're going to set that equal to hash dot new set that equal to yes we're creating a new hash relax okay then below that we are going to start capturing each one of these here's how you do it we are going to insert our first item into our hash to do that you need to write facebook underscore knows underscore all and the first one we're going to set is our first name make sure to put the square brackets there quotations and then you're going to write first underscore name and you are going to set that equal to your first underscore name we want this first name to be capitalized so we're going to do dot capitalize and then we're going to add our second item, which is their age. So you're going to do Facebook knows all again. They know I'm making this video, guys. They know it. And we're going to do square brackets again, quotations, your underscore age. And we're going to set it equal to your underscore age. Now we don't need to capitalize your age. So we're just going to go to the next item. How many kids do you have? Facebook knows all. Facebook knows all. Square brackets. Quotations. Kid amount. Kid underscore amount is equal to kid underscore amount. The last thing we want to know is if they're male or female. Facebook knows all. Square brackets. And we are going to do male underscore female. We're going to set that equal to male underscore female. And then we need to put out our Facebook knows all hash. So we're going to write puts Facebook 
underscore knows underscore all and go ahead and save it open your command prompt and pull in the who are you go ahead and hit enter what is your first name let's go with Jake how old are you let's go with 45 how many kids do you have let's go with four are you male or female and let's go with male this time and now it's putting out our hash first name is equal to or greater than Jake your age is equal to or greater than 45 and get them out so if you I think it was two lessons ago we talked about hash uh, creating hashes and this is how the hashes are written out so we now have these hashes they've even got the commas everything for us already set up as you can see that's pretty sweet but let's optimize our code a little bit let's get rid of some lines so let's come in here and let's get rid of the variable male equals gets dot chomp let's just go ahead and delete that right there and let's just go ahead and get rid of the kid amount and let's get rid of your age and first name come down here let's take that first one Facebook knows all hash and then the variable first name go ahead and copy that and bring that right up to here and paste it right in there and then we're going to come down here and we're going to take the second one how old are you and this wants to know your age so that's going to go right here And then kid amount. Oh, kid amount. I think I lost my highlight. There you go. How many kids do you have? And we'll put that in right there. Oh, give us some space. And then the last one, male, female. Go ahead and copy that and put that in right there. Now you can come down here and delete all this. After that, we're going to take the Facebook knows all hash, go ahead and copy that, and we're gonna place it up here, right up above. Let me get rid of that right there. We can do the cut shortcut as well. And then we're gonna save it. And we're gonna pull it in again, start command prompt with Ruby. We're gonna pull in who are you? Hit enter. What's your first name? We're gonna do Jake. How old are you? We're gonna make us 14. How many kids do you have? Make it zero. Are you male or female? We're going to say female this time. And it's created. I should have named myself Jackie, but the first name is Jake, your age is 14, kid amount is zero, and male female is equal to female. So what did we miss here? What did we get rid of that we need to make sure to add in? Well, right here we can see that Jake is lowercase. So we actually need to make that uppercase. So we're going to come in here, and after the chomp is where we're going to put our capitalize. So dot, capitalize, then let's save it. Start command prompt with Ruby. And hit enter. What is your first name? First name will be Jackie this time. How old are you? She's going to be 22. How many kids do you have? She's going to have just one. Are you male or female? And she's going to be female. And hit enter. So we've created our hash now. First name is equal to Jackie, capitalized now, as you can see, 22. Kid amount is 1. And our male or female, she's female. So I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Two days ago, I uploaded a video on how to improve your social skills. These are weapons and tactics to basically murder the shyness in you. And I know that a lot of people find these video is helpful so I just thought it that I would start uploading them maybe two or three a week so if you haven't checked those out already there's lots of life tips life hacks and actual 
ideas that you can do, actionables that you can do, not just theory. Because really, in my opinion, theory is nothing without action. So if you haven't already, go ahead and check those out. And I am actually going to be on a po- on a podcast as a guest. It's called Coding the Path Podcast, and I'll actually put a link to it down below. My name is Jacob Williams. I hope you enjoyed the lesson, and we will see you in the next one.